Hi everybody, welcome to the video surprise of the day. Today I have a Samsung fridge and I'll post the details for this specific model. I'm going to show you how easy it is to change the filter. First of all, the red light indicates that you need to change the filter. The filter indicator light is on. So, for this Samsung one, it's definitely an older model. I don't have much in this fridge though, but there is a real filter that needs to be changed. So, okay, let's take a closer look at this filter right here. This is Aqua Pair Plus. To unlock, you twist to the left side. You see that's very simple, I guess. So let me see if I can hold the camera and do it at the same time. There it goes, it's twisting. There it comes out. Of course, there's some water that's going to spill over. Old filter right here. Looks like it's a pretty old one. So let's get the new one. Right. So let's put it in. Keep in mind, I'm trying to so film this thing. So to lock, you turn to the right side. Huh. That must be a good sign, I guess. Okay, so you have to hold the filter or reset for three seconds. One, two, three. There you go. The filter's back to green. It's not red, orange anymore. The next thing we probably want to do actually is to flush the system. We need a cup to do that. Okay, so I'm going to turn some water. Uh, some of the different models out there actually needs to uh, flush as well too. So I'm going to hit the, the water. Oh, this one's pretty good. You got to work the water out. That's why I need a bigger cup. I didn't have one so I used a pink spray. And this is normal. Flush the system, flush the air out of the system. Let's go pour the water. Okay, I need to flush a little bit more out. I think we're good. That's all. All the air should be flushed out of the system now. And that's all it is to change the water filter in the Samsung fridge. Very simple, very easy, very fast. Thanks for joining me today. Hope you liked the video surprise of the day. Thumbs up please and see you next time. Bye.